The long Labor Day weekend is coming to a close and many vacationing families took advantage of the somewhat nice weather to explore the Grand Strand. News 13 Skylar Music is in downtown Myrtle Beach with more. Labor Day weekend is unofficially the end of summer and a time when many families sneak in one last getaway for the season. For most, Labor Day is a day without work and without school. The first Monday of every September, many Americans take the day off to celebrate their social and economic achievements. One family we spoke to says he and his family have been coming to Myrtle Beach for years for their last vacation of the summer. Because it's the place we've been coming to for the past couple of years, you know, it's the place where we enjoy the most. My little brother likes the slides and the pools and whatnot, and they, they stay open later, so it's a big plus for him. So. For many businesses, Labor Day weekend is a sign that the summer season is coming to an end. And while several close down, others choose to stay open. It seems like it, it's normal. I mean, everybody's open. You know, our favorite place to come eat breakfast at is Mammy's Kitchen, so we're glad they're open. But we haven't seen anything for the most part that's closed yet, so. A Mammy's Kitchen employee said they were too busy to talk about the Labor Day traffic, but another visitor said she was happy Mammy's was open so she could check the restaurant off her Myrtle Beach bucket list. It's a lovely place. I'm so glad I'm here and I'm so glad I'm getting to eat at this restaurant. <laughs> it's iconic. You know, I read up on it before I came. Torres also said he was most excited to eat at Mammy's Kitchen before hitting the road home. Reporting in Myrtle Beach, Skylar Music, News 13.